Hello, boys and girls. This is um, this is actually not even when I feel like it o'clock because I don't even really feel like it. But it's more like uh, uh, I'm just in a I'm in I'm in a bit of a funk now. Uh, I am so confused about this Patrick Marlowe trade. Uh, I'm befuddled. This what, what, this totally goes against all my sensibilities. <laughs> what's supposed to happen in Toronto now I, I, I would imagine it would be you as well Six, 18 something odd million dollars for a 37 year old guy who did score 27 last year um, he scored 27 goals but he's been on a steady decline and I can't see that going up at this point on their team um, I mean, I, I doubt he's going to redo that production again. It just seems like it's wrong. It's a wrong thing to do. But here's, here's my take on it, I guess. I got to take into c consideration that you're talking about Dumba, Lam Lamorello, uh, Lou Lamorello, um, Babcock. These are like the most brilliant minds in the game. My take on this is simple as this. Patrick Marlowe is like the prototype of what you want your boy to grow up to be. You know, and they got a young a lot of young kids there. Patrick Marlowe um in San Jose is did was such a self-serving human being and self-sacrificial. Um, I've, heard, I've heard stories upon stories about just how great of a human he is. Forget about a hockey player. He gave up his captaincy, and I'd like to know the whole story behind that, but he gave it up willingly without even a thought for the betterment of the team and didn't miss a beat. Um, it's, uh, it's not... I, I just did a video on um, kind of, I, I was going to start in with free agency and what Florida did, but I more or less just went into analytics because when you talk about Florida, you really have no choice. And I talked about how, uh, go check it out by the way, it's uh, analytics and I forget Chris Russell's name in the video, so I said, <laughs> Chris Russell, you idiot. But uh, the, uh, the two go combine like if you're talking about Russell you got to talk about analytics Toronto was supposed to be a I mean they bring Dumba I mean this guy is like analytics from hell he knows every he's one of the most brilliant analytics minds that there is that's why they hired him so Marlowe seems like a not something you would do to a person like that um, although his analytics are not too bad but a 37 year old guy when you're trying to rebuild and you're trying to do all of this uh, you're filling in a spot for you're filling in six million dollars of your cap that you're gonna have to pay a bunch of young players soon fairly soon for what and this has got Lamorello and Babcock all over it and I think, like I said, he's the prototype. He, he, they are hiring him. They think he's worth this kind of money to be able to parade in that dressing room and on the ice and his daily routine and what he does and his character as a human being to show their young players what it means to be a true hockey player. This is what it means to be a Maple Leaf to them. This is what we are looking for. This is what you want to strive to become. And to them, that's worth a whole lot of money. And when I first came out, I went, wow, the Toronto Maple Leafs now are doing it again. They're screwing up. They're finding a way to screw up like they always do. I put it on Twitter and freaking everywhere. Put it on Twitter, and I said, you know, this is. I put it on my Facebook page. You can go check out my Facebook page. It's called Steve's NHL Pros of Wisdom on Facebook. I put it on there, and uh, I've been thinking about it. And you know, this whole analy, I, I've, uh, I, I've, I just got finished doing some uh, meditation with Shemaya Beaver Tooth, and uh, 
I've been doing some deep uh, Nutella baths, uh, getting uh, um, getting several massages from uh, my masseuses in the basement here, um, and uh, just clearing my soul and mind, and realizing that you know there's a there's a thing with analytics that's missing, and there's more to just playing on the ice than possession numbers and uh, all of those things like that. Although they are, again, extremely important. And this is just another thing came right after that that says, yeah, um, I still think it's a lot of money, but sometimes you just can't argue when you're talking about Lamorello, Lou Lamorello, Babcock, and Dumba. I mean, these are some brilliant minds. I couldn't even possibly think of putting myself even close to this, the capacity that they have and understanding that they have. I, I'm afraid that Marlowe is going to drop, but I don't think they care because he's still going to be the epitome of what an NHL player and person should be. And to them, to have that visual for Nylander, Marner, Matthews, um, Brown, all these kids that they've just brought in, to them is worth $18 million over three years. And... Who knows? They could be right. Anyways, check out my, that's my full 42%. I only have 42% to give boys and girls, if you don't understand. When I give you my full 42, I give you everything I have. Uh, don't forget to subscribe. I did some videos, uh, I did some videos on Toronto, Pittsburgh. Uh, I just did Montreal. Uh, and I did the top 10 coaches in the league. Go check them out. Check them out, peruse the, the wisdom, peruse the pearls. Have a great day, everyone. Lots of love to you.